What is up everybody? It is your friendly neighborhood sniper, JB here, and I thought I would bring you this commentary to talk about the Ouya. Ouya. No, I'm just playing. It's called the Ouya, I guess. It's supposed to be a new console. I'll put links in the description, so if you guys want to do your own little bit of research on it, you can do that. But um, yeah, I'm just going to hop right into this. This console is basically a free-to-play console. Every game you get should be free. But the thing is, with this console, with all the free games you buy, there will also be, like, purchasable DLC. Like, I don't know how to explain it, but there's stuff you can get. You can buy the stuff, but you get the game for free, if that makes sense. This is for, like, those casual gamers who play Angry Birds on their phone or Fruit Ninja or Temple Run. Temple Run 2, Subway Surfer, 100 Floors. You know what I'm talking about. All those games. Yeah, this is, like, basically going to bring that to your TV. Personally, it doesn't really catch my attention i don't really think i'm gonna get one of these i might look cool but i don't think i'm gonna put my invest myself into one of these but uh yeah um this thing is said to be released in march and it's going to be a cheap console it should be sold at about a hundred dollars and for what it's worth i think that's that, that's a good price in my opinion for the kind of console it is you don't want to price it up like next to the ps4 and the xbox 720 when they're about to come out later too and um yeah let's look at the specs a little bit we have this thing has one gigabyte of ram when the ps4 is going to have they're saying four the xbox 720 will have eight this is like a tiny little thing it has one gigabyte that's like what the ps vita has and uh yeah graphics wise it's not going to be the best like it's going to have graphics like your ipad would have or your smartphones if they if it's 1080p it'll have somewhat good graphics but they're not going to be nearly on par with the big consoles coming out later this year and uh the graphics wise i guess the graphics that it's going to be running is going to be called nvidia and uh yeah uh there will be no hdmi on this console it's not going to be like none of that stuff this thing's going to only be for games and twitch tv if that makes sense that's that's it games twitch tv Maybe they'll add Netflix later or Hulu or stuff like that. Time can only tell, but for now we know it's games and Twitch TV. And in my opinion, I gotta say, this controller and the system look so sexy. I love how they look. They look so futuristic. It's just like, it's eye candy, man. It like pulls you in like, oh, it looks so good. When you actually find out what the console is about and what it does, it's like, eh, I don't really know if I want that because the PS4 and 720 is going to be coming out soon. But, uh... This console is supposedly going to be like, it, you buy it, it is yours. If you buy it and you want to mod it and take stuff out and switch it and mess it up and play with it and mod it, you can do that. They do not care what you do with it. You can mod it. And yeah. But, uh, so, that's basically all I have for you guys about the Ouya. Um, basically, it's going to be a lot of mobile apps, like what you play on your phone or your, well, your iPhone or your Android phone. If you have one of them Obama phones. Then no, but if, I mean yeah, if you have the iPhone or Android phone, it'll be playing. It'll be like playing those games on your television. All right, guys, if you enjoyed the commentary, be sure to leave a like below and comment. I would love to talk to you guys about this. My name is JB, and I'm out. Peace.